Hi guys, quite windy today. Tijalas, the marina. I have a Galvani isolated. Insert the great only the battery charger. Batteries on 3080. This is the control of the engine. This is the switch. And is Dyneema and logo. Same material of the anchor. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and after a long time I published this video, the winterizing of my Volvo Penta diesel engine with the help of the fantastic Andrea that normally doing many boards. So here you can see my engine and now we start to winterize and prepare the board from the winter and avoid any problem uh, inside the engine. Andrea is a master to do this type of job because I make a lot of winterizing of engine in the place where he work. So now for first things we take out the cover of the lid of the water strainer that bring from the safe drive the water inside the engine and permit heat to uh, cool down. So first time we open the fantastic Guidi uh, water strainer made by bronze and we open the lid of the strainer. It's very well done and very sturdy, so it's not plastic uh, stuff, but it's bronze stuff. This uh, Filter is below the sea level, so the four bolts make a very safe and very sturdy uh, installation. You can see the strainer, there is some debris inside, so now Andrea take out and we for sure clean everything. This type of job, you can do it also with the boat in the water. Remember to close the seacock of the safe drive. After that, you can open, you can clean your uh, filter. This is stainless steel. Time has come to prepare the antifreeze uh, liquid for pouring it on the engine cooling system. Uh, we use water as some cooling uh, liquid, uh, we mix together and we are ready to drop inside the circuit. We go up and we prepare all the stuff. Andrea put the strainer inside the filter, it closed all the seacock and went inside the engine room and I passed the bucket full of uh, anti-cooling uh, liquid and Andrea dropped inside the filter. With the bucket is quite difficult, so Andrea move all the liquid in a small tank, more easy to move inside the engine room uh, to avoid to make disaster and we start to uh, drop the liquid. Andrea asked me to start the engine to permit all the liquid to go on the circuit. We don't need too much uh, cooling uh, liquid, but enough to fill up all the system including the water lock. A visual check to see if the liquid has filled the entire circuit and actually it is because it come out from the exhaust pipe so jump down and we know that there is all anti-cooling liquid in all the system. But guys it's not finished 
to be sure that everything uh, works well, we prefer to do another round of antifreeze in the engine. I won't protect my engine uh, for all the winter, so we prefer to do two rounds of antifreeze. And also in this time, the antifreeze spill up from the exhaust. I start the engine and stop the engine. Andrea used the blue grease for both the filter gasket to prevent water from escaping, both on the threads of the screw that protect them from the corrosion. You can see all the antifreeze that fill up the water filter. It's time to close the lid with the bolts and the cover. The last and not least bolt, and this is the last one, and after that we tighten the cover and the job is done for the moment. Time to clean the engine room from a few drops of antifreeze released during the transfer on the filter. Sandra is cleaning everything. It's time to spray with CRC666 all the engine. This is a protective spray from the rust and the moist and protect your engine from the winter humidity. So I won't protect my engine because I want my engine must be always reliable and always in good condition because you, you know when you need it, when you are in trouble, the Murphy law work very well. So I want that my engine is always in perfect shape and perfect looking. Andrea uh, thinks uh, like me regarding the engine, so clean engine room and clean engine and everything's well controlled and very well uh, done inside the engine room uh, on the engine. This is my advice that I can give you, take care of your engine. Well guys, I seems the job is well done, the engine look like new and it is completely protected from the cold winter and everything will be ready in the perfect shape next season. So guys stay tuned and we see you soon with another video of the maintenance of Albert Rossi 31 feet. Take care and bye bye!